guys, it's David here, and today I'm filming a kind of different kind of vlog. This is going to be raw, might not have as much editing. It's a pickup with my point-and-shoot camera, which hopefully looks okay. I'm going to be talking about last night's Oscars today, and I just wanted to get my thoughts out there as soon as possible. But I do want to take this opportunity to thank Blake Reiner, my wonderful YouTube friend who lives across the street and allows me to borrow his DSLR camera for those videos which are not shot with this little thing. But anyway, enough about how I'm filming this. Let's talk about Lady Gaga. I'm not sure if you're aware, but but what she did last night was and will forever be a career-defining performance. She came at that show-stopping Sound of Music medley with so much effortless skill, showing the training that she has to back up whatever rebranding she's doing. If she wants to do jazz, I'm here for it. If she wants to do pop, I'm here for it. You know why? Because she is talent, she is passion, and she's an artist. And she's not letting people tell her what to do. She is going out there and she's making Julie Andrews weep. And I don't want to hear any complaints about her having to stay in her lane, okay? An artist creates their own lane. The critic can stay in his. When she started on the classic opening sound of music with her high operatic soprano, I not even I knew that it was her singing. She just surprised everybody with her classical skills. And what was funny was that at the beginning it wasn't evident that it was a medley tribute, and so when she switched to my favorite things, everyone's like, what? It's a Sound of Music medley being sung by Lady Gaga? That's like gay brains exploding across the United States. Following favorite things, she did a really heartfelt, quiet rendition of Edelweiss going into Climb Every Mountain. She stuck the last notes, stuck the landing with her arms. It was a complete home run, touchdown, strike and bowling, if you will. I'm pretty sure I erupted in applause while watching in my apartment. It was just such a win for her. I don't care if she has critics. I don't care if some people didn't take this seriously. I know that you could see on her face. She is satisfied. She's gotten to a place in her career where she can show people she has actual talent, and I don't think she's going anywhere anytime soon. She's really one of my favorite artists to watch. I will always have respect for her. She maintains integrity in the pop industry, which is more than one can say for a lot of people playing that game. Anyway, aside from Gaga, there was an entire awards show that happened for three hours outside of that. There were a few other performances. John Legend performed with Common, which was a real highlight. Um, uh, Maroon 5 performed, but I was like in the bathroom for that. Sorry, Adam Levine's hot, but... <laughs> There were a lot of complaints about the lack of diversity in the final list of winners from the evening. I happen to agree with those. I just don't think any amount of cutting to Oprah or Viola Davis is going to make up for the lack of representation. And I know that I'm voicing this from a place of privilege, but that doesn't make it any less important to mention. Also, Neil Patrick Harris's jokes about it during the opening monologue did not sit well with me, along with a lot of his hosting job, to be honest. He just seemed to be in a nervous or just kind of sometimes plain rude mode. I don't know if this was something done by the writers for him or if he was in a weird state, but it just, a lot of stuff had an edge that still didn't detract from the highlights. Lady Gaga's performance, obviously. Meryl and J-Lo freaking out. Amazing. Gift-worthy. Which occurred instantly if you were on Twitter during the evening. By the end of the evening, I have to admit, I had stopped live tweeting because I, I watched till the end, but I just didn't have the energy. Three hours? I was asleep on the couch. I went to bed right after. Anyway, those are just a few of my thoughts about last night's Oscars, but let me know what you think in the comments below. Did you even watch them? Uh, did you think anybody was snubbed? Did you hate Lady Gaga and her red gloves too, or did you think that her performance was legendary like I did? Just feel free to leave a comment and uh, make sure you also hit the thumbs up button, that helps as well. And let me know what you think about these more raw videos. I'm thinking maybe I'll just squeeze them in once in a while when I don't have enough time to like do the DSLR light and whole thing and just like chat with you guys and say hi. And other than that, I thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you very soon. Okay, bye!